Well, if you're in Fort Worth, uh, I think you might be hearing some thunder. Oh, we're, I, it sounds like that's what we're hearing right over our heads. heads. Yeah, no kidding. Uh, when let's was go the ahead. last time you heard thunder? I don't know, but I am so excited to talk <laughs> about thunder I know. and to talk about rain uh, I know, and those like things that otherwise, <laughs> Jeff, that we'd be complaining about. I mean, bring it on. Uh, we like should call a holiday right now. <laughs> Uh, it's been so long. Take a look at radar. This is what we're so joyful about. First off, there's no severe weather, okay? It's just a good summer rain in progress. And yeah, it's been a couple of months since we've seen such a widespread rain, at least over the Metroplex. There is some lightning involved, so stay indoors as these thunderstorms come over you. A couple of things have been going on in the atmosphere. Remember, this rain came into uh, an atmosphere that was sitting around 100 degrees, so we saw some weird things happen. First, this is an atmosphere with dry air under this hot, dry air under this rain cooled air coming down. You get downbursts, and we caught one on the Denton uh, time lapse right there. You see it coming down 30, 40 mile per hour winds, and then a heavy rain. And we're seeing dust devils as well, and this is all ahead of the rain. You see that area that we've highlighted there? That's a dust devil that formed ahead of the incoming rain that was headed into Fort Worth. And, and there were uh, some reports of funnel clouds, or actually these dust devils and gust tornadoes just ahead of the, the rain coming in as it was coming into the Metroplex. Here's a live shot. Uh, Fort Worth, actually, I wanted to show you. The rain coming into Fort Worth, so this is actually time lapse from the last hour. And you see all the dust getting getting whipped up ahead of the rain, and then suddenly it's raining in downtown Fort Worth. Uh, that's worth saying again. It's raining in downtown Fort Worth, DFW Airport. I'm not sure if they've gotten any measurable rain yet. It's been all around. It's 88 degrees, however, so it's really cooled down. And the DFW Airport is reporting delays because of these thunderstorms. They're literally all around the airport. Downtown Dallas and heading into Ellis County, a good soaking rain in spots. I know not everybody's getting this rain, but it is generous, really, for a summertime event. We see the heavy rain going down 820, so we're going to continue to see along 35 and that 820 corridor in Tarrant County get a good rain and look at the good rain over by Annette and that's the airport right there and look look at the dome I don't know if it's going to get rain look what it's doing to the temperatures uh, 79 in downtown Fort Worth and that rain at Meacham 74 right now in Greenville where they had over an inch of rainfall this afternoon we've got low 80s at the same time we've got 100 degree weather down in Johnson and Hillsborough counties this is what we expect for the rest of the evening this rain will die out as we lose the daytime Heating. I stopped at 8, but continues to drop south, so still some of us going to get some of this rain. The next two days, we expect temperatures kept in check. Tomorrow is another good chance of rain. Slightly cooler weather days continue till Friday, and then I'm afraid that hot, dry August weather is going to return by the end of the weekend. But this is tomorrow, and we're seeing some decent rain chances again tomorrow, which just makes me smile. We have temperatures in the mid 90s for a couple more days, and then, like I said, as soon as that rain chance goes away, we so slowly start to warm up and be right back to triple digit high. So let's let's enjoy it while we can. Let's, let's do it. This is going to tide us over for a while. <laughs> Thanks so much.